the time right now is 612 and on, on this October morning we are starting out uh, to embark on another day that's going to feel very summer like much like yesterday when high temperatures got all the way up to 86 degrees here in Eugene even warmer in Roseburg at 89 a couple places in Oregon at 90 degrees including Medford and the Dalles Corvallis you were almost there at 88 degrees yesterday seeing those mid 80s throughout central and eastern Oregon and even warm for the coast it wasn't 80 but it was mid 70s there in North Bend a uh, nice warm sunny afternoon again very similar to what we would see at the end of July and early August right smack dabble in the middle of summer and definitely not what we would expect here in fall now that high temperature that we set of 86 degrees that actually tied our previous record high temperature of 86 which was set back in 1987 the average high temperature was normal for this time of year is much cooler over 15 degrees cooler at about 69 degrees now now, as we head into this morning, we're starting out with mostly clear skies, a beautiful shot of that almost full moon. It is a harvest moon. It'll be full tomorrow night, at which point we'll also see a lunar eclipse between 3 and 5 a.m. A little bit of patchy fog forming here in the Southern Limit Valley. 50 degrees right now at the Eugene Airport. Pressure is starting to drop, and because of that, those temperatures will also start to drop as well. Not right now, though. Still in the low to mid 50s here throughout Western Oregon. Also seeing those 50s over into Central Oregon this morning. No clouds in sight for us, aside from that marine layer, which is forming along the coast. A little bit of patchy fog here inland. What's out there is going to break up very quickly. We still have that large ridge of high pressure over the Pacific Northwest, keeping those skies clear and keeping any other storms from moving into our direction. But here's the thing, as we head here into later this week and this weekend, we are going to see that jet stream dropping down from the north, eventually bringing that storm train right here into Western Oregon. That's going to happen halfway through the weekend and into early next week as well. So as for the next 24 hours and actually for the next four to five days, uh, it's going to be pretty much status quo. Some morning clouds, otherwise afternoon sunshine. Those high temperatures will drop a couple degrees though with each day and for that lunar eclipse which again happens tomorrow morning between about 3 and 5 a.m. we should have mostly clear skies for that especially in the valley otherwise for the coast your highs will be back into the upper 60s some morning fog otherwise mostly sunny winds will be out of the northwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour for the umqua basin it's mid 80s for you dropping into the low to mid 50s again tonight for the Cascades upper 70s in the foothills low to mid 70s all the way up the pass sunny skies overhead and for central Oregon low 80s again for most of you temperatures only dropping into the low 40s tonight and for the Willamette Valley it's mid 80s for high temperatures again pretty much a carbon copy of yesterday just one or two degrees cooler than yesterday afternoon as we head through this week again you notice that the coast is temperatures dropping about two degrees with each day chance for a few light showers on Saturday, heavier rain Sunday night and again Monday. For the Umqua Basin, your high temperatures dropping to the mid 70s by the end of the week. Also seeing decent chances for rainfall Sunday night and again on Monday. The Cascades will move from the mid 70s down into the mid 60s, even low 60s by early next week with heavy rain on Monday. And for the Willamette Valley, high temperatures moving from the mid 80s back down into the low 70s here by the end of the week. Again, gradually seeing more cloud cover with each morning and then we'll see those rain showers uh, Sunday night, which will be some pretty heavy rain by the time we get to Monday. Enjoy it while it lasts. Exactly. Okay. Yeah, it won't last forever. <laughs> All right. Well